Welcome back. We've already heard me talk about all the incredible fashion that I saw at Fashion Week a couple weeks ago. But now let's talk hair and nails. So in addition to clothing, there were some really hot new trends when it comes to the spring styling. And we've got Stephanie and Tamara from Darren Salon here to show us how we can incorporate these into our daily life. Good yes. to see y'all. Welcome see you back. Too. Okay, so one of the things I love about going to the fashion shows is not only are there are there clothing trends, but the hair trends that come in and out every year. And sometimes I see them and I think, there's no way I can do this in real life. <laughs> yeah. But y'all are here to tell us how we can. Yes, yeah, exactly. it's so easy. And so we're gonna show you Yeah, a let's start models. with our first model, Carly. Okay, now this hair um, is gonna be the windswept updo. How did you do this? Tell me about this hairdo. This hairdo is really easy. All that you need is a ponytail holder. And this is like my favorite product ever. This is dry texturizing by Orbe. And if you have really fine hair, this will make it dirty. So it's really simple to kind of get a lot of texture and volume with this. But I just simply pulled it into a ponytail. Um, and then hey, you Carly, can- turn around so we can catch like a good view. Oh yeah, of that, of that ponytail. <laughs> yeah, you can curl your hair. Um, so say you curl your hair second day, you're like, I don't want to do my hair again. I just want to pull it up. Really, you just um, put it in a ponytail and then take a couple bobby pins and just twist and pin. It's really simple. And it looks really chic and polished. Yeah, it really is. Okay, now let's talk makeup and nails. So first the makeup, she's got on some gold lids. I think gold eyeshadow and I think um, like I'm working at a nightclub. But this <laughs> actually it looks appropriate for daytime. Yeah, this season's spring trends are going to be understated eye, but you can use gold as a pop of color. Um, it all depends on the type of gold that you choose. And then we're going for the coral lip to give her lots of color on her lips as well. And then let's get a close up on these nails because these little glitter nails which are really fun if you have a special occasion yes really yeah hold those out for us so we can get a close-up of those and I those love are, these actually are ombre nails um, wow. just like you do the hair it's the ombre with the, the glitter as well love this and we saw this at Jenny at the Jenny Packham show this is gorgeous okay let's take a look at our next model Carrie she is showing us so another version of the ponytail the dressed up ponytail we saw this kind of ponytail at like Valentino and Missoni where they slicked it back mm -hmm. and it was super chic talk to me about this Really simple also as well. It takes about two seconds. Just need a bottle of hairspray or some gel and just slick it back and right into a ponytail. If you turn around, Carrie, you can kind of see it's, there's really not much to it. Just slick it back and go. But it's really slick and right. it's kind of that wet look. I know at Hervé Leger too, they showed kind of a variation of that where they slicked the hair yes. back, they kept it down, but they, it was everything was really slicked and pulled mm -hmm. and chic and I love it. Yes. It kind of gives you like a little facelift. <laughs> yes, yeah, yeah, pulls everything <laughs> back a little bit. Now let's talk about um, the makeup. She's got this winged liner, which yes. once again, the wing liquid liner terrifies me, but this looks normal. <laughs> and we actually didn't use a liquid. That's kind of the key to oh, it. Oh, okay. Yes, we use a gel liner. And the key to doing it is actually lining the wing up with the bottom lash, not the top. So when you open your eyes, it gives you more of a lift to the eye. And then let's talk about these nails. This is what's called the Half Moon Manny. Yes. I love this. This is too cool. And you can even do it with other colors other than the white. So it gives you a little pop of color without being overstated. Wonderful. Okay, now moving into spring and summer, I always think about braids. And this next model, Albana, she is showing this braid that is just so beautiful and stunning and it's like perfect for like vacay and a pool and a week it just it makes you yes. want to go to the beach yeah it's it's super loose what we did is she just has really straight hair so we just took a braid we kind of parted her really far over braided it across the forehead and then if, she, if you turn around bana and show the back um, and then we just kind of like brought it all together so just kind of met the two with a bobby pin so it looks more complicated than it is but if you just split the hair and braid on each side and pull it together into one then you can have this really easy look. And then you just kind of, it's messy. The look is messy this year, especially for braids and, you know, and the updo. So if you just pull the braid apart and make it like look extra messy, then it's the key. And that's kind of the key, aside from the slick ponytail, it, it, it's not supposed to look perfect. Yeah, don't stress too much on getting it perfect. I love this. Okay, now let's talk this, um, the, ma the makeup. Obviously these bold pink lips. Yes. Pink is back. We've seen, we saw that with Neiman Marcus last week. And here again, talk to me about the bold pink lip and can anyone wear it? Anyone can wear it. Um, and it's not just pink. It has to be like a fuchsia or, you know, a coral. magenta or yeah. coral color. Something that's going to be over the top. Now when you're, when you're suggesting to women if they want to do a bold lip, would you suggest that they keep the rest of the makeup pretty toned down just to Not necessarily. Up? Okay. Um, if you're going to do a bold lip, it's okay. Just like we've done with her. She has a really bold eye. She has a metallic gold as well as the contoured eye. And you can see it's not too much. But if you're doing this for a daytime, you know, that's okay as well. And then these nails, they're really neutral, they're really sheer, very simple, elegant. And flesh tone. 
Kind of gives you your, your fingers an elongated look. Yes, I love this. Okay, let's have all the models come back out. So many great, gorgeous trends, courtesy of Dara's. Thanks, guys, for being here. Makes Thank me ready so for much. some warm weather so yes. I can start wearing those yes. braids and wearing all these spring hair and makeup trends. Thank you, ladies. Thank, Thank okay, you. Okay, you guys, you can check out all these great ideas again for your hair, for your makeup, for your nails by going to our website. That's thebroadcasttv.com. Um, and to get all of it done by the great folks from Dara's Salon, of course. Yes, thank you. Okay, developing good reading skills is important. Very important milestone for all kids. And when we return, we are going to cover a few products that make reading fun. Stick around for that.